here is from www.makemegenius.com. If you want to see more science videos, go to www.makemegenius.com. Oh, yeah, it is free. I am wondering how much blood is there in our body? See here, see these five one liter bottles? We have five liters of blood in our body. What is this half filled bottle? This bottle is having half a liter liquid. When we donate blood, we only give half a liter. Yes, my big brother donated once. This way we save lives of others. Do you know that all the human body is made up of many small cells? Yes, you told me many times. Blood is also made up of many cells. There are two types of cells. Hmm, two types? Let me show you. See this picture? These are red and white, but white is less than red. Yes, blood is made up of red and white blood cells. These are called RBCs and WBCs. RBCs and WBCs, what do they do? Red blood cells carry oxygen and white cells fight off infection and germs. So, white cells are like policemen of your body. They fight with dirty germs to save us from diseases. You are right. I also want to be a policeman like the white cells. I would catch thieves so they don't do any harm to people. Ha <laughs> ha! I would call you a WBC policeman. Red blood cells, RBCs, carry oxygen white blood cells, fight germs. What is this high blood pressure? Sometimes I hear my father tell me that he has high blood pressure. High blood pressure. Oh, it means when your heart has to push hard. Why does your heart have to push so hard? Oh, when there is some blockage, there is in the arteries or the arteries become narrow. So, to push blood, your heart has to work hard. Yes, your heart has to work very hard to push hard so that the blood can go to your body. So that means high blood pressure on blood. That is why it's called high blood pressure. What is this low blood pressure? Low blood pressure? Oh, it means blood is flowing at a lower speed. But why is it moving slowly? When arteries become too wide, then blood flows slowly. So the body becomes weak because it's getting less oxygen. I have one other question. Do we all have the same kind of blood? Very good question. Everybody's blood is almost the same, but there is a difference. In antigens? What are antigens? Let me show you one chart. Red blood cells in blood contain proteins. These are called antigens. Oh, the proteins in RBCs are called antigens. Do we all have some antigens? No, not all have the same antigens. There are two types, A and B. We have either blood with A antigens or blood with B antigens, two types of blood. No, actually there are four types of blood. How you said that there are only two antigens, A and B? Yes, but there are a few people who don't have any antigens in RBCs. This is called zero antigen blood. It is also called O type. So, few people have A type, few people have B type, and a few don't have any antigen. So, it is called O type blood. And there are others who also have both A and B antigens in their blood. A and B type. These are called AB type. So, there are four types of blood. A, B, AB, and O. You're right. Now you're going to www.makemegenius.com for science videos. <coughs> It also has lots of interesting facts and PowerPoint presentations for children. 